Hello and welcome to a preview of some upcoming features in our VS Code extension. To use the more elaborate results of a full code scene scan, we added the ability to connect your VS Code workspace to an online code scene project. Today, we'll take a look at an upcoming feature made possible by doing this. Looking at the accounts menu, we can see that we are signed in to code scene cloud. And that means we can use the feature that I want to talk about today, which is change coupling. Change coupling is CodeScene's term for the way some files in your Git history are often changed together in a commit or within the same ticket. For example, when you commit file A, we often see that file B is also changed. How could this information be useful while developing? Well, here's an example. I'm going to add some code to this file and don't mind the specifics since this is just a demo. Okay, and since I want to commit this change, I go to the source control tab. And here we have a new view called change coupling, which tells us that, hey, here's another file that's often changed together with this one. And in this case, it's a test file. We can jump to it by clicking on the name. And let's add a test case. Once completed, the reminder goes away. Another example is in the Explorer tab. Here we can see the change coupling information for any file that is in the currently active editor. This could be useful to know in advance what kind of code relationships you might encounter when adding new features to a file or a class. Here we can see that the file polygon.java is often changed together with other geometry types. In some cases, these relationships can be hard to spot because they may not be explicitly expressed in the code. It could even be a configuration file that should be changed or some documentation that should be added. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this preview. Have a nice day and see you in the next one.